everybody, and welcome back to another exciting episode of the wonderful and wobulous Project Zomboid. Last episode, we got out of a motel hell, and we got through the zombie horde, and we were able to get home and begin construction. Now, of course, all you lovely people always, always, always provide me with very useful and helpful information, and last episode was no different. Um, there is a bug, apparently, right now, where if you build walls directly next to the fence, the zombies can still hop over the fence and go right through the wall. Probably something I should be aware of. Um, and thanks to you, I am now aware of it. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> As I clear my throat. So we'll make sure anytime we build a wall, we're going to be building it one space back. Uh, that's going to be kind of the goal. We're also going to be planning out, and I, I am looking forward to getting outside for a second and looking how I'm going to want to do this, um, a gardening area. We're going to build and wall off a gardening area so we can have ourselves a nice little, well, place to garden. Um, potentially directly back uh, up against this fence. My only worry is that it's just not that big, especially since we have to build one away from the fence. So what we might do is uh, build it over here somewhere, maybe directly uh, across yeah right over here I'm thinking we're gonna build our fence now I'm willing to go one more day of pure construction before we need to actually do uh, another loot run for some food um, I just don't want to have to again usually uh, risk it getting myself in trouble or killed uh, in the process um, while I'm out looting so I'm gonna try and uh, we're gonna start kinda planning out what we're gonna where we're gonna put our garden um, in fact I do know that we're gonna do that um, since we are gonna start looking at, at getting a garden down we might as well let's grab these four here for a second uh, knock out a wall over here and place a door down I think that's a very very smart move um, so we're gonna start kinda teeing it out like this um, we could do straight out from both ends we'll make it a nice big garden of course uh, and we'll start over here and we'll start building outward. Ah, this is going to be fun. I'm excited to have a garden planted out um, and be able to start building and, and gardening is going to be really, really, really solid. I'm, I'm excited to do that. Um, on other notes, on a more kind of general youtube -y notes, I have officially decided... Uh, what, I can build another one. Nice. Uh, not decided. I have officially um, taken off three days of my regular job to focus on YouTube. I will now be working, or taking three days off. I usually only have one day off uh, a week for my normal job, and that day off is dedicated to hanging out with my friends. I have now taken off an additional two days so that I can focus on getting a lot of block recording done. I, it's, it's suddenly become very, very important to, to me to um, have that kind of time because there's a lot of things that I'm trying to do, a lot of projects that I'm trying to work on. Uh, including more killed in action and whatnot, obviously. Um, but on top of it, you know, I have a lot of collaboration stuff going on. I have uh, my Payday 2 series that, that we're doing up into the release, up into and including the release of the game itself. Um, I have a couple of alpha games that I've been desperately wanting to cover for a while that I just haven't had the opportunity or time to do so. A lot of indie games that have been sent to me by developers uh, lately have just kind of had to go by the wayside just because I haven't had the time to actually, uh, you know, cover them, which is really unfortunate. Um, so I'm trying to change that, and taking off an extra two days is going to allow me to do that, which is uh, really exciting news for me because it's, you know, one step towards making this a more permanent thing and uh, allowing me to work more on my scripted and more, like, you know, thought-out series, uh, giving me time to do that is really, really exciting to just think about. So... Uh, we are going to be looking at, you guys are going to be looking at a much more um, regular kind of schedule. The schedule should be working a lot better uh, as time goes on just because I'm going to have the ability to uh, plot out time now to work on those side projects. So if that made any sense, um, be excited. That, that's a, it's, a good, it's a good thing. It's a good thing for the content of the channel. Alright, let's uh, go build some more walls. I want to I wanna get off to the fence. I want to build up to the fence. And then step one away. So we can do that. And then we can do that. There we go. We got two two more walls now. How's our construction actually looking? Um, our carpentry, rather. 78 out of 15 
hundred. Dear Lord, that is a lot. Um, we are also getting hungry, so it's gonna be lunch break for our good old Mathis Bell here. He's a hungry fella. Let's get him some food. He deserves it. He's working really hard. He's like living a normal life. It's nice. He mustn't be. He must be enjoying this to some degree. I know I would be. All right, let's. Uh, I don't want to drink the soda. The soda is just too, too good to get rid of right now. Um, let's. Hmm. I don't want to eat the chocolate. Uh, our food is not as good as I, I would like it to be. Our food situation might be a little bit more stressful. Um, than I thought it would be. So peanut butter is gonna give me boredom minus five unhappiness. I guess peanut butter overall is just a good thing, huh? So have some peanut butter for lunch. It's healthy to cer to a certain extent. Um, and the next two days might have to be dedicated to looting because, uh, like I said, we're in a bit of a worse situation than I originally thought we were. Which is not a good thing, mind you. Not a good thing at all. Alright, now we're going to saw up these up in the logs. We'll start dropping some nails into our inventory. Sometimes it gets stuck, so I have to kind of put it back in the in the bag. Three, four, five. I have ten nails over here. That's fine. Build. A wall. What? I have to saw more logs. Whoops. That's fine. There we go. Okay. Build a wooden wall. One here. I'm just in the way. My character's just all kinds of in the way. All right, we're almost there. We're get we're catching up. We'll take both of these. Obviously, we still have four nails. We can do another four. One. As soon as he's done, one, two, three, four. One more. There we go. Saw into logs. Now I also read in a comment that you guys said uh, I can hold up to 50 pounds uh, in my inventory. So I don't know. If that's 50 pounds before he just won't carry anymore, or 50 pounds before he, like, dies from, from weight. Because that was something that could happen in the older games. You could die from overexertion. Um, and that was a, a real problem that a lot of people had to kind of be careful of. So we could go, what, one more wall before we need to cut it over? So we could definitely do that one, and then we can make another one right next to it. Looking good, looking good. So we'll grab, what, two more logs... We're slowly going through all of our logs, but the construction efforts have finally taken full swing. And you have no idea how happy that makes me. One, so that's uh, four right there. Three, four. Can I saw logs while I move? No, I cannot. So let's saw them. Carpentry, man, it's gonna take a while. We need one of those books, big time. Big time. Those books are gonna be so helpful. Uh, we need to find those intermediate ones. Alright, so what we're going to do here now is we're just going to build what I want to do. Alright, let's just build a wall. Just, I'm going to have it marked, essentially, right there, right? That makes sense. Right, that's a wall. Yep, good. That's going to be one space out. And then what we're going to do is build another wall here just so I can have it kind of marked out where the wall is going to begin. And where I want is the uh, the door to be knocked out right here, and uh, and we'll build a door here rather, right in this wall, and this will be a garden. That's where we're gonna start growing food. We should probably start gardening a little bit sooner. Um, that might be something I'm gonna start doing immediately. Actually, is start gardening. Uh, something that we desperately need to do, as my phone tells me that one of the people I follow on Twitch is now streaming. I love streaming. I need to stream soon. Again, it's been a time thing, guys. For those of you who enjoy my streams, um, it's literally just been work, 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 work for me. So, uh, more so than usual, as I'm sure if you at all follow me on Twitter have heard me bitch about lately, it's just been work has been running me dry. I don't know why. They've just been scheduling me a lot more than usual. I've been working between 40 and 50 hours a week. It's driving me insane. Um, so, that is why I have not had the time. To stream because when I get home instead of streaming I want to sleep um, but I, before I could sleep I have to record which means I don't really have the time to stream as I normally would all right can we we could probably do two more walls before we're gonna send our character off to bed which is fine 
I know this is riveting stuff, ladies and gentlemen, but at least you get to hear my beautiful, sultry voice. I know that much is true. One, two, three. One more. There we go. We'll move ourselves over here. And I'm glad that it seems like that the construction is not making any noise. I know it will at some point, but for now it's not. I don't know if that's a bug or if it's just not in the game yet. Could could be one or the other. It doesn't you know, I don't I don't I don't mind it to be honest with you, because it won't means I'm just not gonna die. Uh build a wooden wall right here. As soon as he plops that up, we can back up a little bit and put another one here. And then we'll call that that. Um there we go. We'll get our character inside. Get him upstairs and get ready for a day of looting tomorrow. He needs to get more food. We need to explore to suburban areas a bit further. Whoa! That made me jump. That could mean zombies. Let's get to sleep and hope they don't end up showing up and busting down pretty much everything. That gunshot sounded really, really, really close. So I'm a little nervous to look out the window. I don't hear any banging, though we are going to fast forward time till about 7 a.m. We'll go down and have some breakfast. We'll have some peanut butter. And hope to all God that we don't end up getting, uh, eat, uh, end up having any zombies nearby. Be careful. Doesn't seem that they got attracted this way, which is really, really good. Um, it is early, early in the morning. We are running off of pure peanut butter adrenaline. And from here, we're going to have to uh, take a look at around our surroundings. Oh! Well, we have a couple of zombie neighbors. It's not, I mean, it's a little bit of an infestation. It's not huge. Could be way, way worse. Uh, we'll take care of him. Okay, now we have a problem. They all saw me. But we're going to take out those two. And we're going to try and swing them out this way. Oh, Lord. Right, we just want to, I don't want them going near my house. That's fine if he stays there. I just want them over here. Come on. I just don't want them going into my house. That's my problem. That's my worry that these guys are going to meander off to my house. Uh, Alright, we'll take the long route. We're going to check the back real quick of my, uh, of my safe house. Yeah, let's go around here. We'll probably lose the... Whoop, we don't want to attract them. Oops, did not mean to press the Q button. Q shouts. But we're not gonna we're not gonna worry about it. All right. So far, so good. Looks like we'll be fine. Easy to lose them. I just need to make sure that there's not anybody in my yard. And if there are, I need to either dispatch of them or drag them away in some way. Uh, let's take a look. Couple, couple there. A little. That one's a little too close for comfort, to be honest with you. Now they're relative. Mm. There, there, there are a lot. One at a time, baby. One at a time. Come on. Up and over. We're gonna pull you away so that when I dispatch of you, you don't make, uh, you don't attract the others. We'll see what we can do. I could definitely get rid of them by shouting. Um, yikes, there's so many. This is, uh, mildly, mildly problematic. Okay, move. Oh, Lord. Okay, up. Up and over. Come on. Let's go. I mean, we'll drag you this way if I got to. Come on. All over this way, ladies and gents. I just gotta get you away from my safe house. I can't have you this close. I don't mind neighbors, honestly. Like, neighbors are okay. I can invite them to cookouts and stuff. Um, but you guys are just like obnoxious. You're the, you're the kind of neighbor that, that like, takes the free food from me. And doesn't give anything back. Come on. Back. Two down. Alright, we'll back up a little bit. Like, as long as I'm dragging them this way, where, where it's progress. Whoa, lady. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. Okay. Ah. Alright, come on. This way. Whoa, man. That was dangerous. These guys are fast. Alright, that's fine. We're gonna swing around through the trees. 
around the house, and hopefully just to cl just play cleanup now for the, the few that are left. We're good, I think, as far as health is concerned. Alright. Good. Oh, god damn it. Alright, well, let's see what we can pull off this way. Let's see if we can get peeled away. God damn it. This guy's fast. Come on, big guy. You are a fast man. One of the fastest. So you need to go down first. I'll back up now from him. Wait for my exhaustion to disappear. Nice and easy. And you died in one shot. Now it's your turn. Come here, redhead. You have no soul. Alright, good. Bunch of dead heads, essentially. Now there was one more that was moving this way, but it seems as though that person is, is gone. Yep, there we go. Oh, I don't know if that one's dead or just... Yep, nope. That's fine, this way. I'm dragging you guys slowly away from my house, and that's all that matters to me. You were fast, so I'm going to try and kill you off. Up and over. Hey, this is dangerous. Don't try this at home, kids. This is a, an experienced zombie survival tactic. One of which... One of my characters even leveled up in blades slightly, so that's why I'm even bothering to even try this, because I know I can at least get them typically in two shots. Sometimes one like that. And always keep an eye on your backside. Okay, that's fine. We'll probably kill off that one that way. Good. Slowly but surely. Now we're going to let ourselves catch our breath. Um, we're just going to try and do one of those. Maybe even one of those. Yep. See how they're slow? So there we go. Nice. Alright, see? Look at that. Clean up aisle 12. All done. Good. Whew. Okay, my heart is done pounding. We have gotten them, rid of them. And now we have some more lawn ornaments. Either way, things are looking a little bit better. Swing out back. And we'll call the episode here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate your support. And as always... I'll see you next time.